Hey guys, Chris Amos here with Winding Road Magazine. Today we are at Autobahn Country Club driving on the field course with the 2016 Ram 1500 Rebel. This one has the 5.7 liter V8 Hemi and is the four wheel drive crew cab. MSRP starts at $46,850 and has 395 horsepower coming out of that 5.7 liter V8. Curb weight is 5392. Pretty cool looking truck. Hope you guys enjoy the drive. Thanks for watching. This is the Rebel, obviously. And uh, what we did with it was we needed a truck and the off-road environment for the half ton segment that went a little further than what was already out there, but not completely nuts. So that was so expensive that it wasn't attainable. So okay. what we had was a great four x four truck platform already with air suspension and all we had to do is recalibrate the ride height to clear the 33 inch meets. Oh neat. So now it's got a lift kit, bigger wheels and tires, a custom interior and honestly you couldn't build this truck for what we can sell it for which is about 42 grand with a Hemi. Wow. So that's the starting price of two wheel Sweet. drive for Rebel and it's a, it's a great package including all of the little detail work that gets done on the truck. But yeah, yeah it looks it looks great in here. We're riding at normal high ride height right now. We're not uh, we're not as high as we could go, so you All can right. actually bump it up another inch or so. Leave it to a pickup truck to have a cell phone holder. <laughs> right. All right. There you go. Yeah, that's right. My my buddy's uh, Ram has that. Yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. So yeah. He's got a newer truck, huh? Yeah, he's got the dually diesel big one with like the uh, nice. beefed up transmission. So. Let's see, if I were in this type of a situation, we'd probably want to be at max ride height. Not really. Not really? No, nah, because you're, you're not you're not creeper crawling and you're not needing it. You can run max high ride height, but now you risk topping out when you go over with anything. You know, okay. That's not it, but it, so you it's lower fine. it I'd, and I'd raise run it here? It at the number three lights. That's number three, okay. But you can play with it. If, if you want to try it at max high ride height, you can. Cool. My mom loves the air suspension on the trucks because I can push the fob and make yeah. it kneel and she can get in and out of it easy. Oh, that's sweet. Are there any sport settings for... You can auto manually shift with those little two buttons on your right thumb on the steering wheel right there okay. if you want to. Oh yeah, gear minus, gear so you plus. Can, you can hold a gear if you want to. That's you nice. You've got Bilstein shocks on it so they just fake heat a lot better so you can take beatings like this a lot longer than a standard pair of shocks. Okay. But the biggest bonus definitely is having 33 inch tires that can roll over there. Now we're running at full pressure right now, just about 50 PSI. If I was going to run like this all day, I'd probably drop it down to 25, 30, something like that. Okay. Something else that we have that our competitors don't is uh, a leak suspension system in the back. Everybody else is running leak springs. Okay. So not only do you have airbags, you also have a leak suspension to manage the axle a lot better. So you don't get axle wrap. You, you don't get lateral um, changes from uh, putting pressure on turns, which leak springs just aren't very good at holding. Okay. Because we actually have links that position the axle where we want it at different points in the suspension cycle. Neat. Yeah, just kind of cruising around here, I can definitely feel that that extra grip from the tires. <laughs> yeah. Are we in two-wheel drive or four right You're now? in four. You're in four, okay. Yeah, we're locked. All right, we'll do one more lap. Got that nice reverse camera there. I've always wondered where were we before reverse cameras. My uh, <laughs> my mom wanted to buy a new 200. She wanted a car, and I said, "Okay, we'll go to the dealership here in California." The dealer bought two brand new black on black Ram 1500s. Took them to an off-road shop, lifted them, wheels, tires. Uh -huh. Put a huge premium on the lift kit, wheels, and tires, and now you got a truck that's really not set up. You know, stability control and everything else. So we can sell somebody a truck like this and it's good to go it's yeah that's right and back by ram engineering right and it's been yeah it's been engineered yeah, properly developed. and developed and yeah definitely there's a lot of good power from that hemi throttle response feels nice Cool. <laughs> That's what it's made for. That's right.